This is Nutty Vision, breaking news with Hector Polo. The International Monetary Fund said on Monday it will have to be sure Greek reforms are on track and will finance by the Eurozone before the fund can pay it out its part of the next aid trains for Athens. Sonia Lek reports. Greece has no option. Tough austerity measures must be implemented. That's the message from the International Monetary Fund's acting head. For a successful review of the existing program with Greece, which means uh, approval of a new disbursement, and that uh, it requires the IMF's executive board to, to conclude that the program is on track and that it is fully financed. John Lipsky's warning followed a decision by Eurozone finance ministers not to hand over 12 billion euros in aid until Athens pushes reforms through Parliament. They've been given two weeks to comply. The recovery in the Euro area economy is broadly sound, but the sovereign crisis in the periphery remains a risk and will require continued action and attention to avoid it causing trouble in the core and spilling over uh, to the rest of the world. Many Greeks have clearly seen enough austerity measures, but Olli Rehn, the European Commissioner for Economic and Monetary Affairs, said all struggling Eurozone countries had to hold steady. Times are difficult. Uh, the reform fatigue is uh, visible in the streets of uh, Athens, uh, Madrid uh, and uh, elsewhere. What we need now is uh, determined uh, bridge building and uh, the resilience uh, to stay on course, uh, on the reform course uh, at this uh, present uh, critical Juncture. Greece's parliament will vote on the new package of reforms on June the 28th.